Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Romance of the Three Kingdoms 11. This is Mysterious JG here. Uh, we are ready to watch Cao Cao launch a big-ass attack against us, led by Ji Hao Yuan, one of his own cousins, one of the major generals, the five great generals of Wei, I believe. Might be wrong there. But definitely, um, I don't know who any of the other guys are. But yeah, he's like a big playable character in Dynasty Wars. Uh, did I send Wan Zhang up here? I hope so, because Wan Zhang's the one who actually killed uh, Ji Hao Yuan historically, so there might be some cool, unique dialogue, although I doubt it. He's going to attack that tower, and he does not take it out in one hit, so that's good. Which means that it will have a chance to strafe him with arrows, which I like. I'm happy about that. Sun Quan has successfully developed Wulan. Developed? Employed Wulan. I have been invented by Sun Quan. He has developed me. This is good news for you folks. It means there'll be some excitement in combat on every turn, not just domestic stuff. And once again, for the first time in a while, I'm really glad I have the kick-ass towers. Yeah, this is pretty cool. The towers survived. These guys took some damage. These guys took some damage. What I need to do now is try to confuse Ji Hao Yuan's unit. And try to prevent them from getting through the pass here. I took almost as much damage as I delivered, even though I'm using spe well, Spears A. Maybe Spears S will have better luck. Spears S that it's significantly better. By the time when these towers get here, they're going to be able to make mincemeat out of my uh, towers, though. When they're, they're, I mean, when the towers, the mobile towers unit gets here, they will be able to destroy, I should say, my crossbow turrets. Is it worth it to send a um, cavalry unit out there now just to re rebuild that tower? really important battle, the battle against Bandit Keep, which is of course led by Bandit Keith. Now I can get over here and start attacking, although I probably wanted to set this place on fire. Zhang Fei's unit has discovered a shrine. South Star, oh, you did well to find this shrine as a reward. I will teach an officer in your army a skill. A person can know only one skill at a time. If they learn a new one, the old one will be forgotten. Oh, um, wow, I wasn't ready for this kind of decision, uh, I don't know what skill they're going to be taught either. Who's a good unit, I think it's the, any unit, any unit where I recognize their name, they're already going to have a skill. Juge Jun I've been using, because he's like Juge Liang's brother, but he's not really a hell of a character. Uh, negotiator... Chen Chen, Chen Dao, Masu, Feishi, Mishi, Spousal Support, Wu Tong, Meng Da, Meng Da, he's got decent stats, who the heck is he though? Oh, he doesn't have very good unit affiliations or anything like that. It'd be nice if I knew, um, Something of his bio, Yang Ren Li Tong, Li Qiu, Li Xiao, Li Feng, Li Si. Pancakes guy, yeah, all these guys already got one. Guo Yao Shi has horrible war, great intelligence, good intelligence and stuff. So if you pick somebody with good leader and good war who doesn't already have a skill. I guess that's the smart thing to do here. 43, 53, uh, 4965? That's not bad. 
66, 61, 74, 71. I don't think I'm going to get much better than that, but let's keep looking. That's Mulan. And Mulan's also pretty darn good. Seventy-four and sixty-six. Sangu. Jangu. Seventy-four and sixty-six. Seventy-seven. Four seventy-one. Okay, the Wubon's still better. Uh. La, 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 la. Seventy-six, seventy-one. Changdao. He's bold and he's forty-two. This guy up here was. Bold and 42. What do you know? Seventy-five and seventy-three. I think that's as good as I'm gonna get. He's timid and he's forty-one. Alright, Mangda, why not? Oh, I get to give them any I get to give them whatever the hell I want. I didn't know I got to choose, but now it won't let me back up. <laughs> Alright, well, Meng Da is gonna get a super awesome power of some kind, but I've gotta figure out what the hell I wanna give him. This is a big freaking deal. I could have made so. I could have gotten something really useful out of this. And I kind of didn't. Gladden Tart. Oh, you know, recovers well with each turn. Able to use sorcery. There's a lot of thought to be done here, but... Oh, I didn't even check and see what he's good with. Attack. All attacks stronger versus weak units. Stronger naval attacks by a weak unit. All right. Officer not captured when defeated. Zero damage from non-fire attacks. Oh, half damage from non-fire attacks. Two times for fire. 50% chance for no damage from weak enemy. Fortitude. With few men, 50% chance for no damage. Regular damage from joint attack. Steal items on defeating units. TP times 2 on defeating enemy units. Capture officer without providence, elite horses. Yeah, folks, I didn't realize I was going to have uh, quite a, this involved a thing to deal with here. And now I can't back up and try to give it to a different unit either. Fleetness. I am going to sweep asunder, lower will of attacking enemies. Masterful one, two p times two and feeding enemy unit. <sighs> uh, go with indestructible. All right, do you want me to teach Mangda indestructible? Now I bid you farewell. Blue burn, and it didn't work. <laughs> And he completely failed to set fire to the thing anyway. But now I've got a shrine. That's pretty cool. Alright, that was interesting. And uh, not particularly deftly handled on my part. I apologize. Let's get up here and deal with this situation. Or did I already do this? And then I got confused and distracted by all that other stuff. Alright. So that's all my uh, combat stuff taken care of. Now it's time to deal with what's really important and interesting. Domestic development. Farm going. Actually, they're better off getting started in the granary. There's nobody free to do anything here. In Pancake Sky City, USA. Now, what officers have I got free to march? Wang Yue Ying could send out her, um... Alright, well, I want to wait until, um, Pancake Sky himself is ready to lead troops. 
But uh, yeah, it looks like this city will have the honor with its 30,000 troops of taking out the 3,000 troops in the plague-ridden city of Guiyang. I uh, once again now have enough technique points to research a basic technique, and I have to decide now. Miju. Hold on a second. Who is Miju? Is Miju Liu Bei's wife? No. Liu Bei. Uh, this would be a dude. That's. I'm thinking of Mishi. That's too bad. Pretty cool for Liu Bei's wife at her own city. Like, Happy birthday, honey. Here's a city for you. In the meantime, they can research technique. Uh, I just have to decide if. All that's left in the, is, is juggernauts that cost a thousand. At least a fire stratagem, which means I can use fire from three squares away. That can be useful, actually. Uh, Gunpower training means with fire's inferno ball. Hell's ember is hell's fireball. Yeah. Fire stratagem is somewhat useful, but um, all the other things in the fire tree are not going to be used in my playstyle, so I'm just going to hold out till I got 2,000 TP. I'm certainly not going to make it easy for them to take. I do not intend to lose that the way that I lost uh, uh, the city that I can no longer seem to find. It's not Jing Yang, is it? Jin Yi, yeah. But I've got other invasions to plan, folks, so let's uh, start getting ready over here. Draining all the gold out of the city, basically. That's pretty much what I'm doing. I'll train the troops. I think it's Juge Liang is on his way up here, so. Sadly, there's really no chance that I'm going to be able to make peace with either of these forces of the south. I've only got two officers down here, it's a bit ridiculous. How's the order of this city? Not bad, though. Actually, there's only two officers, but there's quite a few decent officers. Or Oh, I don't have enough... I can't even try to do any of that stuff. Forget it. I've got plenty of weapons of all sorts. Let's get you guys building some bikes. Uh, maybe you can supply them to other cities later. And we will continue the exciting adventures of defending Shang'an, I believe the city is called. From... Ooh, wow, things are getting nasty up here. Ma Tang did not like losing Wan, so he's apparently making a concerted effort to take Chang on. Either that or Cao Cao's, like, using lots and lots of fire tactics against the invaders. Because, um... Yeah, there's only, like, all those units around here just to stop Ma Songer? Who the hell is Ma Songer, anyway? Is Ma Songer a, uh... Ma Songer a creative character? I believe Ma Songer may be a creative character. Later on officer, Invincible Warrior dubbed Hero Among Heroes, well known for his fortification skills. Yep, that's a created officer description if I've ever seen one. Uh, so yeah, Ma Tang just apparently decided to send this guy out all on his own, and he's facing the entire army of Wei. Everyone who's not facing me, including Luigi Underfaki. Now those are swords, so apparently Cal... Cao Cao's got, like, regular troops out there because he doesn't have enough armaments. Interesting problem that he's facing. But yeah. I'm certainly not facing the full might of Wei at this point. It all seems to be, uh, defending that city from, like, one of Ma Tang's units. Oh, this sucks. You guys are getting... You guys are getting butchered! No, this isn't going well at all. And now they're gonna take out those towers, or possibly troops. Got nothing. Hi, Guan Jing. I'm here to serve in a way that brings honor to my father's name and to be of use to you in any way I can. I certainly don't want to stay here forever. Yeah, I figured it was a prisoner escaping. Oh, I'd better run.
normally have the chance. You dick. I think I've made just about enough with this place. Damn it, they're escaping left and right now all of a sudden. Unfortunately, I'm unable to. I failed to employ. Wait, you going? Now somebody's gonna ask us for a ceasefire. Possibly not. Ah, oh, it's you, Xiao fans. All right, welcome. What business do you have today? Your force is holding Xiang Wan captive. Please release the prisoner for 1,380 gold. What are you saying? You want us to release Xiang Wan? <laughs> They've got 3,000 troops left, and they're spending 1,300 gold to get back a political officer. All right, I agree. To release the prisoner. I'm grateful. I'm so sorry that our leader's a retard. I'll take the Arctic's prisoner back with me then. Yeah, why not release some folks? That was kind of stupid. Maybe I shouldn't talk about being stupid when I've got the city being attacked and I've not left it ready to defend itself. But... have been reduced to now they're about 9,000. These guys have been utterly crushed. I don't even know if they can pull out. What about you guys? You guys are not very good cavalry. What do you got here? Spears. Yes. Oh boy. Maybe a tactic of some kind is in order. Not a tactic. I mean, uh... Strategy misinformed would be nice if it worked, but it won't. It won't. Highly unlikely. Yeah, alright. What about a fire attack? Why is a fire attack not gonna work there? I wonder. Hmm. It's the best, but it's not really gonna be a good move. Yeah, I just wiped myself out. And Futong has become a prisoner. Crap. Well, now I really need to try and uh, finish off uh, this unit so I can try to get Futong back. This isn't going well. I probably shouldn't even be attacking with this unit, but... more than I took from them. Crap. I just really, I kind of want to get uh, Fei Tong back. I mean, I, I just, you know, he was part of, if I'm recalling correctly, he was part of that famous duel in which we got uh, Sun Wukong on our side, so I'd like to sort of reward him for that instead of, you know, letting him get his ass killed. Archer unit would be a pretty good idea to have out there to help fight off... Uh, few days out, but it's got a lot of goodies for Young On whenever it shows up. Yep. Yep. Maybe we can 
get something for Futon. Under the circumstances, they're just not getting the Futon back, is that what you're saying? Alright, well they don't think I'm going to get Futon back, but what about, uh, getting some kind of uh, surrender out of Liu Zhang? city that's out, so we'd really have to funnel everyone through that one area. Oh, boy. Let's finish this. Punk-ass bitches. Oh, no, and they got supported by dudes. And... and they're sowing confusion and stuff. Oh, sucks. I don't like this. The towers are going to have to do all the damage while my units basically just distract them from destroying the towers. Guan Yu's party has arrived, though. This could make a difference. It's just officers. They didn't bring troops with them, but... Markets are being destroyed. That's important. tower back here. Here, let me say, if I got long range, it's not that long. <laughs> yes! Fires of death! Excellent! looking up a little bit. Always does when it's your turn. But that unit is really weakened now. And they were S spears, so they really should have been able to do a pretty damn good job, all things considered. Now, I've got enough gold and officers. I can really do pretty damn well here. Who have I got at my disposal? Guan Yu, Zhao Yun, Wei Yan, Mr. Sirius, and Zhuge Liang. Wow. The uh, Shu All-Stars are here, folks. Sent? No, no, I can't have all of them out there recruiting right now. I gotta get another spear unit going. I don't have enough spears. Shit. Costly, but I'm going to hold Shang Yang, I believe. 
hopefully I'll be able to get that officer that was captured back. And uh, everything should be hunky-dory soon. Let's drive you guys into the poison, eh? Shanghai! This place will continue to burn. What does it feel like to burn? It burns, brother. Okay. Where's the actual city here that uh, all this is being fought about? Uh, I've gotten confused, folks. This part of the map is very confusing to me. One officer free to drill the troops. What? Zun Wukong, I'm relying on you to, you know, not suck here. I really wish that these guys were ready to start attacking, but they're not, so for Soon Wukong to get done building whatever it is that I signed him to build so he can lead the attack. Huan Yue Ying is going to probably end up taking the city, though, unless I really work not to, because she's going to be the one leading the siege units. She's going to set up siege tanks uh, protected by bunkers and missile turrets, so it'll be pretty cool. Hey, boy, I got four pieces of free land. Uh, I can do a granary. Well, I need to do a granary. I'm just kind of surprised I don't already have one. That's it, we're out of officers. got the special power from the South Shrine, South Star, or whatever, but considering that I wasn't counting on that happening at all, I can't be too upset. And Ji Hao Yuan's unit, uh, they've captured one of my officers, they've broken a couple, they destroyed one of my units, they've seriously damaged several, but Ji Hao Yuan's unit's in trouble. It'd be really nice if I could capture him, but it's not terribly likely. <laughs> Destroyed my S Spears unit, but there's another one coming now, motherfuckers. And I think the development in Chang Sha is ready, which means I can start my next attack on the next turn. That'll feel pretty good. And you guys can continue to get pelted. Yeah, awesomeness. And these guys are shooting special burning arrows because they're on fire. That is my preferred way to defend, folks. Tie the enemy up within range of more than one of your towers. I love it. Now, this is how you want. This unit is now pulled back behind some other guys. But he's... Wow, he's... He's a lot weaker than he was when we started all this, folks. to get the spears to not... Wait, Li Tong is on my side. Never mind. I'm confused. Come away. I will get killed by your spear units. Yes, Eon! Eon! 
I have no more cards to play. The victory is yours. Wow, we actually surrendered without putting up a fight. So that's how it must be a really crappy boss to work for. <laughs> Let's see if we can incinerate some of these fuckers. Chi how you on. We want to capture that officer that you captured. We want to get him back. And uh, I think the best way for us to do that involves setting you on fire. Oh, this is supposed to be happening. <laughs> Mr. Sirius, you will have your chance. Now that you're in the north, you'll probably get to be part of the conquest of Ma Tang's territory, so, you know, be happy. You're happy, Mr. Sirius, aren't you, Mr. Yes, Alright. Shang Fei's unit is severely weakened, but, uh... I should at least be able to finish these guys off. Did not capture Bandit, though. I should probably end this turn and then in the video. I've only got one officer here who's free to do anything, so it'd be nice if they could hire somebody on this turn. Whoever they are, they do not appear to have a super high charisma score. Can they go get uh, Liu Zhang to surrender, whoever's hanging around in the city? No. What? It's wasted 100 gold by increasing the order by one. Dick. Hey, what do you want me to do? Jeez. Alright, so. That's right, I said I was going to be able to launch an attack on this turn. Should have saved some AP for that, hopefully I've still got enough. Oh, I still have an officer of some sort who isn't ready to move. But it isn't Soon Wukong. So let's, uh, let's see, we got... We got plenty of everything, folks. Send out a cavalry unit. and wood oxen, Wang Yue Ying. Oh, I'll send you out there with that. I'll, I'll leave an officer in the city. I'm only going to have one left in the city, though. She will take our tower. The tower of power. Enough food for 120 days. And, uh... That way I've... I've got a couple of decent officers who will be there to help me recruit Shi Grimoth. When the time is right. Reward some dudes. Any reason to search? Nope. It's, uh... Can we get this guy? No. Can we get this guy? No. Can we get this guy? No. Can we get this guy? Yes. Now got one officer left. I don't know if they'll be able to convince anybody to join us, but let's not even try. Chang Du's probably got 
to better officers, more charismatic individuals. Yes, excellent. And now my action points are used. I can come up here, watch Wei's next round of attack, and end the video. So let's do that. successfully employed Gauding. I'm Gaudi Gaudi and bout about it. I'll join Liu Bei's army and help in whatever other way I can. I too have a cool star scream air intake helmet. Relations between my army and Liu Zhang's army have worsened. How much worse can they get? That dude on the other hand who I thought was actually gonna be all awesome, I uh, totally failed. I will restore our normal view. No. We'll end the video. Um, yeah, as you can see, it's um, gonna cost a lot of lives on both sides. But uh, ooh, now they're launching another attack wave. But these are swords, and pikes, crappy pikes, and swords. What are they doing? So if I didn't know better, I'd think that they were like fending off an attack for which they weren't prepared. No, they're gonna send some crap units at me. I'm fine with that. They're much better off waiting until Ji Hao Yuan gets back to the city and putting some pikes under his command. But they're not being that patient. Uh, so I'm going to rebuild this tower. I didn't even lose a tower. I've got one officer that I've lost, and if we can take out Ji Hao Yuan before he can retreat, we'll get that officer back. In which case, uh, things will have gone really, really swimmingly in that defense. And we'll have a nice battlefront here with Cao Cao, where we can kind of, as I've made many jokes about throughout these videos, suck off his troops. All that is to come, folks, as will the fall of the bandits, the fall of Liu Zhang, the fall of what's-his-name, who has Xi Grimoth working for him. And eventually we're going to be ready to take on Liu Kong, Ma Tang, and the Three Kingdoms will finally get going. Um, I hope you'll tune in for the rest of that, folks. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.